<clears throat> gas prices are skyrocketing as we speak. I was watching an art, um, a video on ABC with Diane Sawyer in which this reporter on the street was showing that the gas was $4.99 a gallon and then on a... Uh, um, uh, and on another, immediately another excerpt, it showed it was five dollars and nine cents. Gas prices are, are increasing, and people don't have any clue as to why is that happening. Well, it's happening because, again, once again, we this this is not a country. This is not we don't we don't live under a government a government that cares about you and me. No, 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 no. It's it's a corporation. Okay, we live under the law of water, and in under the law of water, you are on like chattel, okay, and you don't have a say in anything. There are multiple videos on YouTube that explains this very thoroughly, but you know I understand, I understand that American idiots and dancing with morons is far more important than the, uh, knowing your lawful God Yahweh's rights. I understand. It's more important. You're going to get your ass kick from left to right, up and down. And things, folks, I mean, those of us that actually understand what's going on, look, you need to have some sort of preparation. You need to have s several... You know, on, on this instance, because of gas prices are increasing and they just continue to increase, you have to have several gas cans filled with gasoline. Because you just don't know. You don't know what could happen. Anything could happen. This is not a joke. This this is this is real. This is happening. <clears throat> I mean, it, it, for, you know, forget the warnings. We don't know what we're talking about, and yet you look at the gas prices going up. Look, look at the prostitute whore corporate media saying that you know Israel wants to uh, attack Iran. Well, that sends speculators and manipulators up up the uh, wazoo, uh, increasing uh, fuel prices. And the corporation in the United States of America will allow it because it's a corporation for profit. It's a private business for profit. And it's making money. It's make, it, that's all it does. That's all it does. It's a forced corporation and uh, pretends to be a government telling us that they... Look, folks, if, if you don't get this through your head that your voting is completely meaningless, nothing will. What's it going to take? I mean, in this news excerpt, they're saying that in Alaska, they're paying $6 to a gallon. In some places in Florida, $6 to a gallon. In California, it's already a, a top of $5 a gallon. But, you know, unfortunately, the, the uh, people are just, you know, they, they, they've been so thoroughly conditioned to uh, just don't worry. Our leaders are, wor folks, you're not, you, you're not, you're not, uh, um, they're not. They're not telling you the truth. They don't care about you. All they're counting is on your ignorance. <clears throat> they, they're they're going to take your retirements. They're going to take your pensions. They're going to take your homes. They're going to take your cars. They, they can't take your children. Because we are ruled under commercial maritime laws. And under commercial maritime laws, your chateau. And that, that, that big capital names that you have on your driver's license and every other document, that's a, that's a, 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 a corporate fiction. It's dead. It's not alive. That's how you conduct all, everything, you know, from going to the store and purchasing gas, going to the courtrooms. Police officers, they, they deal, they're not dealing with you. They deal with the corporate fiction that is written on your car. But you're not properly educated. And you don't, I mean, don't cry a foul when, when, you're, uh, when your money's worth absolutely nothing and you can barely, barely make ends meet. It's going to be hell on earth unlike anyone has seen before. It's going to be painful. It's going to be horrible. It's taking place right now, right before our eyes. And we just continue to do Business as usual, it's no big deal. Our, our great leaders have our 
uh, uh, best interest at heart. Are you kidding me? Who buys that? Who, who in their right mind could possibly buy that crap? There are leaders put Jesus Christ on their dog on chest, but then they uh, they're over here saying we're gonna dog and bomb the crap of Iran. Really? G did Jesus Christ bomb the crap out of other people because they don't like them, or because they don't do what they're told to do, because we say so? Who in the right mind thinks that way? You all need to wake up. This is it's gonna become a nightmare. It's, this is not a joke. Gas prices will continue to rise. You're going to get your ass kicked. It's going to be depressing. It's going to be rough. It's going to be tough.